Westlake districts are battling a structure fire this morning. And that structure is next to a four story apartment building. We do have KCON News reporter Tina Patel live at the scene now with the latest. We can see the big presence behind you. Uh, what do you know so far? Good morning. Well, firefighters tell us they have this fire knocked down, but they're still going to be here for a while, mopping up, assessing all the damage, and then trying to figure out what started this fire. It's the red building, the two story building where the fire started. And the concern was to the left of that building is a four story apartment building that had to be evacuated because they were worried the fire was going to spread. Take a look at this video shot a little bit of. Uh, earlier in the morning. This all started around 2.45 this morning. Uh, crews were not sure exactly what started that fire, but what they say when they got here to 7th Street near MacArthur Park, that one building was completely engulfed. In fact, it was too dangerous for their firefighters to actually get inside, so they had to get outside of the building, kind of fight with uh, hoses going above to try to get that fire out. Unfortunately, these buildings in this area are very close together, so there was concern about a church on one side of the building and then an apartment building on the other. They ended up evacuating everyone from that apartment building. No injuries that we've heard of, but a lot of scary moments for people who were inside and it wasn't sure exactly what was on fire. Here's what one resident told us. As soon as I smelled it, I woke up. So I smelled the smoke first and then I was like, that seems really, really close. And then I looked out, I opened a window and I was like, oh, that's, I turned all the ACs off and then I ran in the hallway and then I heard fire to like for, I heard firemen. And so a lot of people really scared, woken up, not sure what was going on. Again, as we've heard, no injuries to anybody in the apartment building. And it looks like the fire itself did not spread, but it's still going to take a while to see if there's some smoke or water damage to those apartments. So those residents still waiting to figure that out at this time. Again, we're still waiting to hear what might have started the fire. Neighbors tell us that that building where it started was abandoned, but there are a lot of homeless people in this area. They thought they had seen some chains cut and some doors broken in the recent weeks, so they're not not sure if somebody had broken in there and perhaps started this accidentally. That, of course, will be what investigators will be looking into as the morning goes on. But right now, they're just trying to make sure that the fire is completely out. That's the latest in the Westlake District. We'll send it back to you.